Violent protests erupted in Tuticorin on May 22 as locals took to the streets demanding closure of a copper factory of the Vedanta Group over pollution concerns, leading to police firing. Chennai, the Madras High Court today issued notice to the CBI on a bill seeking a probe by the agency into the police firing in Tuticorin in which 13 people lost their lives. A vacation bench of Justices T. Ravindran and P. Velmarugan directed the Tamil Nadu Home Secretary to consider the representations of the petitioner, an advocate, in this regard. The bench posted the matter to May 30 following a request from Narmada Sampath, additional advocate general, representing the Home Secretary, for filing the counter. The petitioner alleged that, it was prima facie clear that several police personnel were directly involved in the killings. Submitting that the CBI on its own cannot initiate investigation in the concurrence of the state government was necessary, the petitioner said he had already sent representations in this regard to the Home Secretary. Only a probe by the central agency, which is answerable only to the special bench of the High Court, would infuse confidence and assure people that the law of the land is prevailing, the petitioner submitted. Referring to the shutdown of internet services in Tudakoran and surrounding districts, the petitioner said people were unable to know the real happenings. The state has no right to deny its citizens the right to use internet services, he said. Responding to a query from the bench on internet shutdown which has affected students applying for engineering courses, the UG submitted that normalcy was restored only after internet services were snapped in the three districts of Tutakoran, Tirunelveli and Kanyakumari. Besides, the facility for submitting applications in these districts have been extended for another three days, the UG said. Violent protests erupted in Tuticorin on May 22 as locals took to the streets demanding closure of a copper factory of the Vedanta Group over pollution concerns, leading to police firing. Over 100 people were arrested for protesting police firing on Tuesday and Wednesday in the port city that left 13 dead. anti sterilite protests, DMK demands Tamil Nadu CM's resignation Sterlite protests, GOVT assures action, respecting, people's feelings anti sterilite protests, Delhi. HC leaves it to NHRC to decide lawyers plea for probe Sterlite protests nothing new, Vedanta has been in the crosshairs of activists for long anti sterilite protests, DMK, allies called Donta Dusk Band tomorrow commenting feature is disabled in your country, region.